Since the year 2010, the World Bank, through the International Development Assistance Program, has been funding construction of various key infrastructure projects in Kenya under the Kenya Transport Sector Support Project. Through the assistance project, the bank is also financing the emergency renovation of the Jomo Kenyatta International Airport, which was affected by last year's inferno. Through the IDA program, the World Bank Board has approved another round of funding totaling to 17 billion shillings to finance the Arthur River Machakos Stanov section, Bachuma Gate Magia Chumvi section, and Kisumu Kakamega Webuya Kitale roads. The project will also help the Kenyan government upgrade major sections of the Northern Corridor, which runs from Mombasa through Nairobi to the Kenya-Uganda border and the Western Corridor, which extends from Kenya's border with Northern Tanzania through Kisumu, Eldoret and Kitale to the South Sudan border. Modernization of the construction of interchange at three major junctions along Nakuru Nyahuru Road, Nakuru Njoro and Mausamit Kericho Road will also benefit from the funds. Meanwhile, Infrastructure Principal Secretary Engineer John Mosonic says that, contrary to some reports, major development partners have not shied away from financing the development of the 600 kilometers Leseru Kitale Lodua Lokichogyo Nadapa Road project. This is um, where we have a delay in the project, and uh, we have to resolve this issue within the next three months. Otherwise, you'll not be able to achieve our target date of July, uh, August of next year. The funding comes at a time when Kenya is facing a shortage of qualified engineers in various sectors. O'Brien came for business defined.